and a very warm welcome back to Why in the Morning. You're watching Why in the Morning right here with me, Brian Sakwa. And remember to still stay on the hashtag Why in the Morning and on this segment, hashtag MCM. We are talking about being Kenyan. You know those things that unify us? They're like, you know, this set should be like a bochard edition. But you know those things that make us sound like we are funny, we are crazy, weird and awkward but in a good way? That's the main topic of this conversation. And on that note, we had asked you on our social media platforms, ni warnings gani kama wa Kenya? Ambazo tuchukua wangi serious. Unajua sometimes, especially pale pa kufile returns. Unajua tunapenda last minute rush, nini nini. And it's just unique. It's like a, a culture or something we have developed. And joining me right now on set, I'm not alone, to take on these conversations are two guys who are comedians. And uh, I'm going to let them introduce themselves. So I'm going to start with the guy who seated immediately next to me. And uh, welcome, guys. Introduce yourself. Hey, thank you so much. Uh, my name is John Harlequin. Yeah, from G Quit. Welcome. Thank you. Do you wh what do you do mainly? Uh, comedy. Okay. Yeah, and I'm a student. Welcome. Yeah. Next. Yes, they call me Gilbert Marshall. Okay. Orodege. Okay. Uh, I'm a writer, script writer. Okay. Uh, my YouTube channel is Tija Couples Comedy. Okay. I write about love stories and shit. Mm -hmm. uh, I do journalism in uh, in Jaquat. Okay. Yes, that's what I. I study the certificate I'm going to get. Okay. Yes, thank you for welcoming the show. Okay. I hope you enjoy all, all, all of us. Welcome, guys. This is like a kabocha edition, so I'm <laughs> Yeah, yeah. And interesting enough, both of you are comedians. Mm. And in this country, the memes and the Kenyans on Twitter will always kill you. And right, at, right, right now, Kunele, Kunele Msemo in Asama, Katasim, Tupo Sai, Tupo Sai. And how this guy came to trend on social media is just out of nowhere. Yeah. Is it like a culture in comedy? And, uh, it just unifies us and it creates that humor and that pizzazz of like, we are funny and it is what it is. <laughs> Kenyans, uh, like, when I was in Kenya, I was a comedian in Kenya. Uh -huh. Yeah, we were just crazy naturally, and yeah, that mentality me, yeah, it may take in our mind like uh -huh. everybody. So everybody is just funny in its own way. Uh -huh. So it's just our culture as Kenyans. You, you feel like it's our culture. So yeah, you know, it's it's in us. It's inborn. <laughs> yeah. It's inborn madness. Exactly. What about you? It's just let me say uh, uh -huh. that day it it will reach, you'll go viral. You uh -huh. never know. Yeah. Like you don't plan to say, like that person say cut a simple. You didn't plan to say the, the next day, then say I'm going okay. viral. Yeah. Yeah. It's just something that happens naturally. Even yeah. now you can just be funny, then you go naturally. It's just natural. Yeah, it's natural. Thing. Yes. And speaking of like anything can go viral, like was it yesterday? I think a couple of two uh, days ago, there's this TikToker, Ali Kula Spider. Uh, spider. The Batman. Uh, and <laughs> he, he's eating like a variety of like, and, and inedible foodstuffs, and he's doing it for content. Do you think that even as you as comedians, Munenda go to the extent, ya kufanya zile vitu awkward zana to create attention or to make people laugh? I'm going to just get the numbers online. Okay, addressing that personally, uh, yeah. yes, he was doing this for content, but to some extent, he was uh, exaggerating. To yeah. some extent, let me say so, because he went to an extent of maybe putting his life on risk to entertain others. Uh, there is this uh, a celebrity who, who told him that, bro, as much as you're doing this content to entertain us, but make sure you're not risking your life. But then we as comedians, yes, we go, we do awkward things, but not uh, like putting your life in a risk for yeah. the sake of this. Yeah. Let it come out naturally. Let you not force anything. Yeah, let's just bring it out, but don't risk your life. Awesome. Uh, and what are some of the crazy jokes? Like for you, both of you are comedian. It's interesting. Yeah. What are some of the craziest jokes that will like, z z ni natural? In as much as it will maybe ziko zina boundaries, what you could mention, but in natural, whether you can tell, you can say that you can say that you ni boy child edition. Struggles boy child is something we don't want to talk about to some extent because yeah. this pressure we are passing through as people and uh, we're like, we don't want to talk about the, these openly to the lady so we bring it to, into the comedy part so after all it's in a comedy but then you're just saying the truth in a in a different yeah. manner in a hilarious way yeah, exactly. so what is what is the craziest joke you've ever told like at your circuit like, check and they're like eh, 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 this one is killing it okay personally uh, i'm not so much into the state thing okay yeah, I, I do script. Oh, you do mainly script writing? Ma mainly a lot that of That means scripts, you write so. crazy jokes, right? You yeah, can I tell us some that. of the craziest ones. 
uh, okay there, there, there are many like there are many my favorites like yesterday i i uploaded a video uh let me just mention that it yeah, was sure about mention. this this guy like quarantine my boys but i want to okay jana mwenyele juanga madem wote <laughs> like you are just mentioning a lady vi car one dem namjua oh dem namjua vi car asha ikuwa na e ada likuwa na mtaka na ya mtaiki like the yeah I, they always know so tunakonga na watu kama hadi ukiacha story na madem this that guy mwenyele juanga kila kitu naanza to story hivi they pop in we yeah. know that yeah. so i think the, the video was personally to me i shot it yesterday it was really crazy to me and the ending and it went to extend that now i was the guy that knew everything and the guy really slapped me he slapped you <laughs> it was that serious it was a joke like and it was comedy and he slapped me really hard a serious joke yeah so <laughs> that led to a slap it really it is led to a slap so su- such things they are really really us but then we are not bringing it an aspect of now doing something so awkward yeah, yeah it's just the simple things that matters no. but then you do it in 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 a comedy way interesting what about you my man <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I don't do so much of stand up comedy but uh-huh. <coughs> the craziest one you've told uh what I do mostly is uh, I do scrutiny you scrutinize people and put them like yeah, in like, a <laughs> so I, you for example Vera Sidika if you are to like focus on Vera Sidika unge scrutinize nini sana sana kwa nini macho yetu unaribu kwa jamani like that one I'm referring to the body shape and uh, uh-huh. no she's a very fine nice lady <laughs> yeah yeah so to make her like Uh, in order to bring that aspect that she she's a size 8 yeah. i just say she's reading our eyes you know that yeah. like boys are attracted to such things and true yeah mostly i do i uh, can only like if i say you i think you're short i just think yeah. <laughs> not me sure think you're short so you visualize the person and bring the comedy out of yes, them yes but sometimes you know you, you want to make it in a way that the person doesn't feel uh, like oh. you are doing discrimination or yeah. something yeah Uh, like you make it to be in a funny way so you, it depends on the environment yeah i can't start joking with somebody i'm not used to okay on that note kuna zile kuna zile warnings zenye hata zimekuwa na gava like everybody knows it's like mm-hmm. universal law usipite hapa usipige picha ukiwa hapa usikanyage hapa even on the zebra crossing pale kwa barabara kwa road unaona tu msia anapita wameka foot bridge lakini msia ata cross katikati ya barabara ndo afika on the other side na amacha foot bridge like what is the problem shida na kuanga nini kwa wakenya time <laughs> it's time na just being rebellious aha uh-huh. kuniambia nisifanye nitafanya uh-huh. that's the thing mbona niambia nisifanye iko nini so you want you want to go against the rules <laughs> yeah it, it's just natural it's it's a natural instinct like, and it's kenyan if you tell me that do not go behind uh, the screen or, or let me say behind the that door yeah i'll be like why but mm. why ni kwa nini mm. eh then akupiwa so mm. mm. bana kaona nipiga nipige bas acha niingie hapo ni wewe ni wewe acha niingie ni wewe mbona anambia ti hapo nini nisingie yeah so she's hata kama kwa roads wanasema do not pick or drop passages here yeah sana niache pesa amadon cross here niache pesa niache pesa ti police ako ati do not pick on nini hapo yeah that na smama na ona smama una ona kuzo na ingia <laughs> is it is it because we are illiterate like you mentioned ama it's just it's just something that comes because it's coming and you just have to do it is it curiosity okay you know making laws is is kind of like you did not involve us why should you why should you tell us that do not cross here do not do that, do that this we must just test lazima tuone so yeah, yeah lazima nianze kwa nini unaniambia hii chai nisikunywe yeah. ati mama amesema yote iko kwa jikoni mtu asikasiguze yeah. yeah. eh kwa nini nisikunywe sivunya mama akitoka hiyo kiusongi ita, itakuwa tu mingi kwa nini sema ukabati nisifungue ama hiyo chai kwa nini kuna nini <laughs> i must go and test or shit like it's just something eh? yeah. like mbona ni kwa nini like curiosity ngine tu yenye it's, 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 it's out of nowhere yeah. and especially if, wakati tulikuwa tuna grow up most of us the 90s kids mm. kulikuwa na zile rules wazazi walikuwa wameka wamesema nisikupate umepita sitting room ama nisikupate umekalia hii kiti mm. bla 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 but out of nowhere you will sneak in the bedroom <laughs> sit on the table and do all the madness yeah. do you think bro it's something that 
it's, it's maybe inspired from like way way back and it's just a character we are extending or we are just playing we are just playing a character that has already been defined especially when it comes <laughs> to the rules and regulations that are there okay yeah sure go ahead you know like no nobody would like to be a subject to one yeah you personally everybody always want to be on top yeah kila mtu anataka kushare yeah so like una kujuna niambia uh, you have to be under me to a point of feel kuna venye kuna tu venye unani, unanionea yeah let's say for example tp pale high school anakuja oh no let me, take, yeah, let me take that teacher pra let me take let me take for okay. campus kuna yeah. kwa exam yeah. and umeva kufia and there are those lecturer who when you attack ngi mtu avai kufia yeah. so mko na wenzako hapo umeva kufia and they are like ebu to you to you kufia and mwenye anakuambia is not a lecturer but then is there to supervise yeah. be like sasa so, huyu mtu ananiambia ni toy you know you very well usipotoa iko fear unaenda kwa punished Okay. You lose another excuse. Yeah. Ile kutoa tu iko fear. Baadaye atu akishaenda, unasikia jota manini. Just not to be under that person. Another thing like the, f- kwa pastor kwa kanisa anasema, ana preach then unasikia, go and read the book of John chapter 3 verse 16. Ah. Mbona ananiambia nisome hakuna haja. Yeah. But then pastor akikuja akasema, usijaribu kusoma hiyo na Yohana chapter 3. Yeah. Mbona ananiambia nisijaribu? Okay. You'll just go to you'll just go there and confirm. Mm-hmm. There are a lot of things people do for a, for instant we tunafanya ngo napata hiki kitu tume nini hiki kitu we know this as warning just to 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 branch up kwa warning. Uh this this can be to to some point okay let me talk about STDs. Yeah. Yeah. Sexual transmitted diseases. The Ministry of Health or Maker Vizuri do not like uh, an, an unprotected sex is will lead you to this. Yeah. Really need to use really need to care, take care anytime you're doing this anytime you're doing this you need to use this use protection use protection to, to avoid yeah. the consequences of unprotected yeah uh-huh. you people are really knowledgeable and mnafika hapo site yeah shakata simu zote mfika hapo ndio like yeah and anyway, we need to use this thing sini sawa yeah. let's go ah kido after around 3 to 5 minutes utasikia si tutoe Yeah. You, you get that like you just ignorant the ni ignorance in yeah sense. ignorance not sumbua and speaking of ignorant do you feel ni kama kuna kuna ile aspect ya joy uki break zile rules una feel like when a hero uki break zile rules zenye zimekwa wamesema usipita hapo unapita slippery wet floor wewe unapita yeah. do you feel like ina, inafanyanga Kenyans tunakuwa heroes in an ignorant version of it <laughs> you know like rules are naturally meant there to be broken because be right. if 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 there is no rule then hakuna makosa okay yeah if there is no rule then hakuna everything will be right but yeah. then rule ilikuwa brought ile wengine tukio kwa makosa and then ukifanya wamesema tufanye hii na nikafanya na hakuna kitu imenifanyikia unaona yeah. yeah. this in this in this life kuna kongana kuna kongana the unlucky one and the lucky one uh-huh. and most of the time you find yourself in the part of the unlucky person okay, unlucky. <laughs> So no fata um tame fanya kitu na kuna kitu imemfanyikia mbona mimi pia nisifanye na nini unapata yeye akifanya hivyo ana succeed everything anafanya mbaya mm. so you want to ah uh, i want to be the boss yeah let me do what the, this yeah, person is doing the and the cycle yeah. continues because nobody wants to humble themselves okay yeah so at the end of the day we end ourselves in a in a cycle in a cycle Yenye, the same same pattern yeah the same same pattern yeah. mimi nataka kufanya hii mimi nataka kufanya and at long last this one nataka the same level Yeah. Benye tuli sema no one want to be ruled. No, hakuna mtu anataka kuwa sub. Yeah, kila, kila mtu anataka. Mimi nataka kuwa leader. So we do that like we feel too. Yeah. 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 Mimi bazenga. Mimi ni mzi. Mimi ndio wakusema. Mimi ndio wakusema. Eh, unajua hadi mkienda audition, watu wanachapa jokes hapo nasema, "Enye mimi ndio nilitoka hapo nikiwa, nikiwa bingo." Unaenda to extend hadi kusema vitu zenye unasikia ume ume pass boundary to some point. Yeah. Yeah, so you are you exaggerating ili to be the best. Okay. Yeah. And speaking of that uh It, it, it's yesterday and maybe a couple of days ago kuliko na hii hashtag trend twitter the 32 joy riders i'm sure uli come across in relationship to omanyala lenda oregon who represent kenya but it happened before before the year fike oregon kuliko na like 32 others who will be fika wenye uko naenda kucheza hiyo race na it happened omanyala ka delay like even like a day before. before so kenyans on twitter were jumping and they were like uh, criticizing and hurling insults at the daughter of cs amina mm. do you think uh, social media yetu inatumika sana ku expose the evils that are happening in terms of even the rules that are broken do you think especially twitter 
especially hashtag KOT inatumika sana ku expose the evils hata kwa comedy ni nini mm. before i come to you okay kuna mtu alisema this this meme that was standing that ukitaka kujua kuna disability ingia twitter jipost twitter twitter like in this country kila mtu anataka kuwa recognized let me say so to some point you feel you feel client on taka kwa cognizance i feel so country. okay when you like these people when you they so much get into social media yeah. unapata they will be like every news in akuja kila unajua mtu ana struggle day and night looking for something to post una, una when you not have content to post the, the same thing or not have any wrong thing mm -hmm. like now they are not focusing you unajua there is this this um, kuna kuna tofauti the difference between co identify evil to criticize now that cloud chase yeah they look alike but they are really different uh -huh. for example utaona mistake there uta feel u jamaa kuna kitu fanyi poa then utajaribu ku identify juu awezi mu approach uweze mfikia utajaribu ku highlight what afanyi poa in a way ataelewa na change then another person atakuja seme u jamaa kuna kitu kuna kitu mbaya na yeye let me now bring it exaggerate it impact mm -hmm. that's what we are doing like we want we want this thing to kila mtu every kila mtu mimi yake anataka mimi yake go viral yeah so the the reason one part of kenya they do this they tag this they tag these people wanaangalia huyo mtu waseme hivi waseme hivi most of us we are just looking for for, for numbers It's basically numbers It's basically numbers nothing else but do you think it helped to raise awareness that uh, omanyala le delay and kulikuwa na mesh up kwa hiyo hiyo ministry Yeah, yeah it, it it does na nimesema ziko close but then ilifanya hivyo but then the mentality and the person who mtu like hiyo kwa intention yake ukiangalia vizuri yeah intention yake ilikuwa kuonyesha ujamali delay and there is a reason we need to look at this yes kuna mtu angeangalia seme what is, what is the reason why umanyala delayed mm -hmm. what is the reason for his de, the reason why mbona ali delay and all that yeah. but then huyo mtu kuna reason mbona ali al tag so the reason mm -hmm. is just difference Uh -huh. Any angle to really take angle to really take part but yeah. then a wise person anaangalia anasema enyewe this person trying to bring this message but then unapata then mwenye mwenye analeta news hadi ana hiyo intention ya ku bring that that thing mm -hmm. that Omanyala was was late yeah alikuwa na intention nyingine ya yeah, kutanish yeah. the daughter exactly uh, do you think really this idea in in terms of social <coughs> media na ku expose evils zenye Kenyans wanapitia majorly uh, it only went viral when Omanyala didn't win didn't become the first person in the race uh -huh. <coughs> because when he arrived there was not, there was everybody was silent uh -huh. but after the race now yeah. because but he proceeded he did a very good work mm -hmm. but people were expecting him to be number one number one through all through the sessions all till finals to semi finals and everything but he made it he made us proud yeah. so the reason why Kenya and really are now so much into that we expected Omanyal to be number one but now that was number three or something Now people are angry. Mm. It's like I'm expecting you to be always getting A. Then you then you came you came to exams late. Then you get an A minus. That's where another scrutiny will come come from. We don't scrutinize something if we don't expect something. We expect it's because if he had if he had arrived late, then he became number one. Kenya now could be boasting. Mm. Even if I, I wake up late. I am still the G. Kenyans yeah. are G. So you get that situation. Yeah. But he still made it. He made us proud. So majorly uh, the the social media thing, they say we have freedom of speech. Yeah. Uh, so now people are looking at these other people who arrived earlier. Maybe they used their own their own money or, or something. Because so Manyala this year is being sponsored and, and everything. Maybe somebody I said let me go with my own, my own money, but being that it was it was late That mean that now we all have to now just be negative negative the, yeah. the positive side also yeah he tried he tried but now we can't now bring the 32 people down and oh, oh me but you know mm -hmm. kenya you, you can't tell me to keep quiet i have my phone yes, it is my data that is your data <laughs> my, <phone, laughs> yeah. my data my data wants to me at at ni eh? uh -huh. even so is it kwa idol ndo inafanya watu wanakuja tu social media kujibu because for example kuna i think when rington rington aki post something kuna kuangana matusi kadhaa pale kwa comment section ni nini because watu hawa believe he's like a legit gospel uh, artist do you think wase jump in or wanna jump in to because vile umesema wako na data na simu ni yako do you think it's because of that Um, mostly because you no know, haters are going are going to continue to hating that's the fact okay so they are haters in short 
some, 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 some are haters. Some are good. Okay. If I comment, nice work. Uh -huh. Somebody won't say that uh, this person is idol. <laughs> yeah. If I if I comment, but uh, you have a very bad voice and shit. Somebody say you you don't have like that is the one people have to concentrate on. Yeah. The thing is, uh, our society now is it's all about the phone. Mm -hmm. Because the moment the the time that we spend on our on, on our phone than uh, with our friends is much more. If I'm online, what is am it I? Lesser or much? It's it's Do too we much. Spend, we spend time on phones on as to, compared on, to real. Because one on one conversations, you know, it's really less in this. I say yeah. it's really True. less. Like, yeah. I, I better not if my friends come to visit me at my place, uh -huh. it's better we just keep quiet listening to me. But everybody's on the phone, yeah. I'm chatting somebody who is even in, in Malaysia or something, just far, mm. just looking for something to look, then uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. something interesting, boring. And the society nowadays is in the phone, yeah, uh, because somebody even. Before I eat, I must just look at my phone after eating, before cha even charge. If somebody can even be texting, but he's, he's in charge. In charge yeah. <laughs> the man of God is there busy preaching. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> I'm okay dead. I'm okay dead. I'm too dead. But, but, <laughs> but I'm okay dead. 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 I'm the bad boys are in a flight mode. Bad boys. Yeah, they're in a flight mode. I'm scared. Bad boys are in a flight mode. Do you care to have a message messaging here? I'm super cool. Is that who is that texting you all the time? Who is that texting you? Apo na sama she doesn't anzang. So many the scientists now in the phone. So we get yeah. some Kenyans like we can't say that we are idol. We also we also busy. Mm. In some way. <laughs> in, some, in some sort of that, way. That is not uh -huh. stolen. That data must be worked for. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's the fact. Interesting. Wanasamanga well, Kanairu is one big bedroom. Mm. <laughs> and they say Karibu Kanairu, Karibu, Karibu Kenya. Karibu, Karibu, Karibu. What are some of the traits Zinafanyanga Iose in a come to reality? As you look at Kanairu, yani uko, be ready. Be ready for a very stormy ride. Kanairu. Uh, what experience <laughs> yako ni gali before I, I come okay. back to you? <laughs> your crazy experience in Kanairo. <laughs> come again, this is a, like in what uh, perspective? Especially relationships na mabocha. Lazima <laughs> tuonge <laughs> leyo se kabwana. <laughs> Wait, before ni fiki hapo, uh -huh. this guy uh -huh. uh, is a poet by the way. He naitua Tony Vox. Okay. Tony Vox. Kuna, kuna his poem, uh, he naitua uh, The Conversation. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ntasema tuntokut line yake filani uh -huh. ati... Nini, in the, the conversation. So he was talking about Nairobi. So he said, Nairobi big bedroom, Uliza Ben Sol. Ata kamenya takusho, vijana wa nagoro, si usingizi tu, pia kuna site za po, no. So like he was talking about, by the way, yo, yo, the conversation like is a really good, it's a really good, Nini. He talked about Nairobi in a, in a very nice manner. And uh, big up to him wherever he is. Okay. So. Nairobi ni funza mingi. Sama mbili tu, mbili tu. Mbili tu. Mbili tu. Hey, this, 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 you know, like when I say, ma, okay, I, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, like, I have to, I have to say this, but it, it's just what is happening. Okay. So, like when I say, ma, uh, ni leo tu ana, leo ana kukis, ni jana me blow job, okay, kumbuka kifu, ibu, bro, don't. So, something of the sort, he said that. Okay. So, this thing is, it's really crazy, by the way, and it's, it's, it amalizes a lot of our youth. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Kwa sababu, na taku multitask, manzi. Yeah. Wesi machini. Mm -hmm. Usafu wa mwili muhimu pia. And uh, usafu wa mwili muhimu like if 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 you just can't maintain, achana nayo. Is it from a personal experience? Uh, I'm just saying cuz I have people in uh, like mimi ni jeni mtu yeye. Ni mtu niko na watu wengi actually hadi sifanye kazi peke yangu. I have I have a team. Okay. Nyenye na work now. Uh -huh. Like from my, uh, my 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 people. Labda nikipata time tawa tawataje hapo hivyo ni wapi gap. So like we, we we share the experiences. So napata you are, you are dating somebody. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me talk about personal experience. But I, shortly, I, I, shortly, shortly. I, 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 was, I, was, I was in a relationship. Okay. So, in a relationship, Kumbe, you are I'm, I'm dating somebody. So, I'm dating somebody for three months. Na he is in a relationship for six months. After? After he, she's no. done the previous? I'm but like, dating, but I'm uh, on a double date in short. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, more than when you date na eh. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, how? Like, to me break up Leo. And, and they're like, well, you have to three months ago. <laughs> so, like, you, you're sitting down and saying, this is the time you waste. But they, like, what are you, long story, but what can I just say, if you're going to waste time, you better just leave them alone. Mm 
Okay. Yeah, just don't waste their time. Because people are many. People are many who are in the line. What is the line? What is the line? What is Yours, bro, first of all. Personally, <coughs> Nairobi is not a bed of rose to, li to lie on. Uh -huh. uh, personally, okay, it's not a good thing, but uh, it's only by God's grace. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> never walk alone in Nairobi. Never, never dare walk alone. Eh? Mm -hmm. Because personally, I was, uh, I was, let me say, uh, same as Karibu ni chikuliwe simu ya. Ngama karibu ni simu. Wale ambiati? Maliza simu, alafu ulet. Kutipatia. Eh, Maliza ulet. Mm. So I'm like, eh, rada. Simu yangu ya mea, like, I'm still <laughs> new and everything. Simu yangu ya mea ni late. Oh, uli kwa mniu in Nairobi. Yeah, I'm still new. Like, son, I'm still new, eh. Zile za big city and shit. I wanna do some rounds, eh. Mm. Ti Maliza simu ulet. Uh-huh. Mza zile za mba yu niko, eh. But likuwa na hanga watu na, eh. Ukona simu yu mtu anduudhi. So na shanga, ah, rada. So na watu wangina wawilo na nikuzia. Bro, Malaysia simulate. Yeah. But Mja Mungu pia ni mzuri. Yo siku ilikuwa tu siku yangu. Like I'm kind of tall and shit. Because ever a wazi. So Mja like, they also afraid in, in some way. Like wikiwa, wikiwa mbea tu wazi, wana kuwacha. But kawe, you're also weak. No, mtu watu ngene, wana kupima tu akili. Yeah. Nairobi ni akili. Emotions wana plaka kaa ushago. Plus this other thing, Mazejo, it's not really nice because... Uh, uh, Nairobi manze like what ni like mise maji uh, the unfortunate wako wengi the less fortunate wako wengi uh -huh. like upite hivi kuna bega upite hivi upite hivi like sadi oh so ji let's have when you so ta was ji utafanya nini ji manze so you can't help everybody in life but you feel eh? you feel a fuck ji mja kusaidia uyu kidogo kidogo upite hivi kuna mwingine kuna mwingine kuna mtoi so na feel too eish kwa ni government yetu manze na wa Kenya manze like eh, but njia like you can't change the world for yourself sasa bi unajikausha yeah unajikausha manze unafanya unakuza una, unafanya vitu zako ukiendanga yeah. ni umesaidia ni hivyo uh -huh. but kama tumekuja tu pamoja manze mm -hmm. sidani kama kunaweza kuwa watu hawa tu kwa streets manze but sasa ubaya wengine pia ni wakora ya yeah, kweli kunao mimi mati nimeona nimeona mtu akona wilcha na mgaki imeparara Gaki parara kwa nini? like okay ni aso but sasa ugiwe parara aji like ni kama like wana fake it. Yeah. Ni kama mtu ana fake it ulimu saidia and shit. But so said ni anataka hivyo jumja like making it manze na like ku discriminate watu si poa manze. Mja like wezi jua. Speaking of speaking of that kuna kuna some politicians where immediately na pia na speech yake lazima kutakuwa na ka exact katenda viral. Na I'm sure kuna wale wanajulikana like Atoli. Hata sometimes Matiangi juzi kulikuwa na place and quantity. Ile walikuwa na dance kidogo kidogo lakini movement yake, choreography yeah. yake haienda yeah. 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 na <laughs> And then baba naye vile anatembea sio sio na imitet. Is it because these people have made it like a wamefanya ni kama ni culture like kila wakati ukienda kupea na speech lazima tu itatolewa na lazima iende viral na especially ikikuja kwa comedy and shout out to Ekebe Mimics who imitate to Huru who imitate uh, Ruto who imitate Raila San do you think is something that uh, you know as you as comedians should learn from it and use it okay to say umetaja tu let us a comedian that <laughs> guy but uh, that that guy like hata kama despite the fact that anakuanga anapigana kelele sana yeah. it's like is is really entertaining Kenyans in a way yeah true uh, so it, it's it's something that tunasoma like these people tuna bring that that creativity out of it so despite the fact that in inaweza kuwa hapo inatuonyesha a lot of stuff but then it, it just bring the creativity aspect out of us na ukipata ini vitu like mtu kama Raila Kalte yake the way you movement the way ana dance the way ana tembea inakunga tu hiyo moja at really ajai change anakunga mm. tu even these people it just bring that umeona hii kitu how what can you make from it yeah. like what the comedians are trying to say that the, that's the perspective i'm talking from In so what wana kupea content to like you, you, you can do, like wanakwambia uangalie yeah. this thing in a different yeah. angle yeah. so na unaangalia ukijana memes kwa scene like it was it was it was giving out a speech and then akafanya hii kitu hii kitu si lazima ikuwe tu like criticize this thing is a content itself to make Kenyans love yeah, yeah. yeah so just bringing it from another aspect of life what do you think mostly we want to bring laughing out of serious things yeah 
ni kama ku break monotony yeah mm -hmm. when i'm telling saying shenzi shenzi sana mm -hmm. it's very serious not joking true zayo saut like this the, the main thing of that saying that she is so supporting azimio and uh, and everything and it's really serious about that but now as obvious you know it's everything in this world let me say everything is there what we do is we just alternate yeah. you can't say that i can write my own book right now mm -hmm. Because of this, I'll, getting, I'll, be getting, I'll be having my references and, uh, okay. and my, my citations. Mm -hmm. So the main thing is, even uh, President Ruto Kenyatta, there's a time when he was saying, uh, uh, Ruto is not helping him and, uh, and that, at Alikuwa Wapi. Uh, like, when you come to me, they're they saying Uru is crying. Now yeah. they, they have that effect. Those graphics, mm. now Uru is crying. <laughs> you're not helping me, something like that. So like, who yeah, does this like a person who, yeah. <laughs> who has to cry, but it's really serious. Yeah. So majorly yeah. uh, as comedians, uh, the serious ones, the, the big ones, you no, know, maybe as uh, 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 the growing ones, when they do something, it's not seen. Yeah. But the big ones, the they, big ones were the like, fathers of comedy. Yeah, yeah. Kena, Kena, like, Kena, Kito, like is Kena father of comedy. Yeah, he's a, he's a comedian. That's how okay. he's a G. <laughs> So okay. there's a time yeah. I was imitating Uunye every time after in, in finishing a speech, when he starts t t touching the mic, mm. yeah. it's nice, yeah, yeah. now he has to complain. Uh, like yeah. they make yeah. it a way that those are really serious people, like we really imitate them, really want their, like how those people make their wealth. Uh -huh. Like you really want to be like one day like them, like okay. that's financial stability. Okay. Now such people in the, when they're on social media, mm -hmm. what we try to do is follow them, obviously we must just follow them, they, naturally. Yeah, because me, somebody will say that. Because we must learn from them. We yeah. must learn from them. Mm -hmm. The educated ones will say they take the education part. Then uh -huh. they, but now they, we must just bring comedy in it. Mm -hmm. Do you think it's celebrated enough in Kenya? As in comedians are highly revered. It's lukewarm, lukewarm. From your experience, even as a, you said you're a scriptwriter. Yeah. Yes, I, in Jija Kapu's comedy, like it's still a growing one. Okay. They say uh, you work hard. It's only by hard work that you'll make it. Nobody will bring a, a plate onto your table. Okay. That's the fact. You must yeah. go get it. So celebrations, mostly I can say from what I've learned and I've seen uh, what the other, like Churchill, Churchill show, he has tried to raise people up. Like I'm seeing him holding the hand of comedians. It's really nice. In part of celebration, it only depends with how you are known. Like when I make you, that's the fact. Mm -hmm. So Nijina, Sindo. Nijina, Kwanza. I always celebrate with that. That's the fact. Okay. Final one. Do you think you are celebrated, even in your journey and your experience? Do you feel like umepata your aspect here, like imekuarahisi, as you look up to the fathers of comedy? I mentioned Churchill. Ah, yes, ikuarahisi. Uh -huh. So it's just a matter of uh, just kupanda until you pick a point. Now at least you can see the, that platform. Yeah, what? Because after all, what they started from somewhere. Now it's just a matter of doing this thing. You do it consistently until they notice this person is not going to give up. Because a lot of people are in in our level, and then after after some time, they they, they fade off. Uh -huh. So until they see now, this person is not giving uh, is not giving up any soon. Uh -huh. Now you come to the family, something of the sort. So it's just a matter of some few steps. You get there, and now, to, like, a, a point, then Utanda could feel now, these people are, 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 are wana, wana kuwa, wana, wana jaliwa, na wana pendo. Mm -hmm. yeah. kuna, ile, kuna ile aspect ya kutaka instant uh, gratification. Umanza tu kuandika jokes, juzi juzi, and then unataka ukue kama chache. Do you think it's something, do you think you can have instant gratification and be famous in a day na upendo kila mahali as compared to like taking 10 years in writing? We have social media, technology is yeah. there. Yeah. The TikTok guy manyame kula bats, now he is viral. Of mm. course people will remember him. Yeah. Do you think it's easier it, with it's social okay. media? Okay, to, to some point, yes and no. Yeah. Because Babu, you never know, you're like, you never know what people are going to love. Okay. When I do like, okay, as a, as a script writer and as a, as a content creator, when I create content, I'm kubamba, I'm going to check excessive kitu iko fit, giving it to the people. What the fuck? What was this? Mm -hmm. Like, uh, they, they, it's it's not that much into them as it was to you. Yeah. So I kita ikujangi somebody knowing that I'm going to to be viral. Okay. When my brother Lisema, like, 
uh, add um to when we create things are to do this this thing inaenda kugo viral lini so you're just creating out of yeah you're creating unbelief. something <laughs> unapata one year later this thing now going viral yeah. so you never know when when it's going to happen okay. but surely when you don't give up it's going to happen yeah yeah so you never know inaweza kuwa yake inaweza kuwa unajua siku yako ujui inaweza kuwa umeshoot video leo imeenda hivyo Mm-hmm. So na struggle na sangle then upata tu video tu moja hivi it clicks you up. Uh-huh. So it's just a matter of time. Na, uh, as you as you as you st- stick on that one nataka you tell me one of the craziest com- com- comedy lines yeye ushaipeana uh, ushaandika because m- umesema mostly mnaandika nataka u- 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 create mods hapo and then utuambie about a chekesha audience wait as i come to you. The craziest one the craziest right line umeandika because it's like running out of time ha huh? <clears throat> uh mama ushago akikuja nairobi like we had to like uh, wear ourselves like women then we slide yeah uh-huh. slide the, to the stairs but mostly i do couples things like uh, i was even thrown into water <laughs> just to bring the comic the comic thing so majorly uh there's a time we we shoot a video of uh, what women when then in the club they they know this wanyanya wanyanya kikokwa kikokwa club like nowadays they also do the shako shako thing yeah yeah true. okay you think that was funny <laughs> and it's a video so it's funny oh, it's a video it's on youtube yeah okay <laughs> that, that that's that was your last one your last one bro the one you uliandika and you felt like he liko imeweza kabisa as we wind up okay I'll, I'll, I'll mention in mind I have a lot but I'll mention one okay. because I have around 63 videos so like okay this is just from from real life my zone apata you're in a relationship i uh, imagine so much in relationships unapata like you with your girl there ama ama if you're a lady you kuna boy wako hapo and then your relationship is a bit a bit private and kupotea potea hivi kufika fika mtao na unaambia watu when this kizume potea what's up like mbono sieke relationship yake kwetu open unamwacha sasa hiki tikuwe open you put umemweka hata umemweka status ukamweka IG ukamweka Facebook Twitter mweka everywhere so me ndio una, unamaliza hizi vitu then hiyo ndio time anakuja manzee hizi work okay unapata that thing is really painful by the way ushaeka ukajitoa soko mm. <laughs> unarudishwa na kila kitu like anawaambia it can't just work so if you don't nilifanya hadi mimi nilifeel manzee okay. yeah it juu imefanyikia watu mabishto wangu yeah imefanyikia watu wengi Adi so, personally so. mama <laughs> you are you, are, you have experienced in <laughs> I have experienced it and i think we are out of time mm-hmm. and uh, uh continue sending your feedback on hashtag why in the morning remember we had asked you a question of the day what are some of the craziest things uh, craziest warnings not even craziest warnings that kenyans do not like obeying and keep your feedback coming and i think we'll end this conversation here and in just a bit we are back with much more